Trying out Windows 11 has never been this easy. This free Windows RTP can be created in just a few clicks and the best part about it is that it doesn't require any credit card or any sign up information at all. Before I walk you through the steps of creating this free RTP, I want to emphasize that this video is for educational purposes only, we shall not be held responsible for any misuse of the provided content. All you need to do is to go to your browser and search for Windows 11 in React. And then you're going to select the first link from Blue Edge. Let's wait for a little bit. Creating the Windows 11 remote desktop is that simple guys. You don't need any account or anything like that. Just click anywhere in the screen. Then click on sign in. Now you can read the about over here which will tell you a bit about this project and it will give you the licensing and also the contact information for the developers of this program. As you can see here it tells you that this is just a Windows 11 desktop experience on web using standard web technologies like React and CSS and JavaScript. It also tells you that they are not affiliated with Microsoft and should not be confused with a Microsoft operating system, meaning this is actually not a Windows 11 from Microsoft, it's just Windows 11 skin, but we are going to try out a few things to see if this Windows 11 uh, is usable or not. So let's go ahead and click OK, I understand. Then now let's try out a browser. So let's open Microsoft Edge. Opening Microsoft Edge, you come to something like this. You can see you can search your stuff over here. Let's try speed test. Then you can run your speed test if you want to run your speed test this is just an example as this is not an rtp it is using your own data bundles to do the speed test which is why this speed meter will be quite slow because my internet connection is not that good guys as you can see i'm running on 8 mbps per second which is the download speed and 16 mp per second on our upload speed so we can also try out a few things over here as you can see we have the microsoft store we have the store over here i cannot call it the microsoft store since they say it is not from microsoft which you can find some few games and few applications which you can install and try them out i've already tried installing few of the applications and i didn't face any problems they actually work let me show you an example by installing a simple game let's find a simple game which we can install and try play let me try this one and uh, let's try this simple game and click on get after after the, the game or the application which you are installing from the store has been installed you will see that the store will close itself all you have to do is to reopen the store and click on open or you can just close the store and you will find the installed software or game on your desktop just like this one so let's go ahead and open the game And as you can see, the game plays pretty well. You can start playing the game. As you heard, this free RTP also comes with the sound, which is good if you want to watch some YouTube videos or you want to watch some videos or you want to like play some music and stuff like that. You can do that on this free RTP. You can also download and store some applications on the file explorer which the only problem i wasn't able to check the storage and the ram 
of this rtp since it doesn't allow me to do that i don't know how you can actually do that but i've tried and it didn't work for me this is how you can create your own free windows rtp with just a few clicks if you find this video useful please give it a thumbs up if you have any questions or suggestions don't hesitate to comment them below and of course don't forget to subscribe to our channel so that you won't miss our upcoming videos until then take care and peace